all Webkin's Kitty Tan here, and I am so happy today because I got a vamplet! Oh, I don't even know if this should be considered a vamplet though, since technically this is a zombie baby. Just saying, not a vampire baby. And, okay, so I will explain how I got the zombie baby. Because this video. Who knows when it will be up because I edit videos like a month after I shoot them. So this is the month of October right now. So for one, I was like, oh my gosh, I should go look at the Vamplet website because, I mean, it's October. And it says that some of them are now in stock. So I like wanted to go see like what vampires are in stock now. So they have all the new ones that they had on the whole like Kickstarter page. But then it was like limited edition, get it while it lasts. And I saw... Mortis Van Kilt, and I remember from the Kickstarter they said this wouldn't be available ever again. And then I saw that it, like, I'm guessing they had like leftovers from that, so I'm like, I am going to get a zombie baby! Since like it will never be available ever again in the whole entire world. So I convinced my mom to get it for me, and um, I'm getting it in, in place of like a uh, allowance. And what I didn't know when I ordered it, I was just m focusing on the baby. I checked today, and it said that if you ordered it, you got a free bottle of blood, and I did. Oh, it's so cute. And it's the disappearing bottle of blood. So, ready? I'm going to feed my zombie baby. I would think zombies would drink blood, too, because, well, they eat, like, brains and stuff, so blood should be in the same category. Okay. Sorry. Here we go. Nope. Every last drop, and then it fills back up. I used to have, um, or maybe it was my sister, but someone used to have a bottle like that, but with milk. I think it was my sister's doll. But, oh my gosh, this doll is so soft. Oh, feel him through the camera. Ah, oh. and he's adorable. I think it's he, because it's Mortis Van Kill, so I think it's a he. And the diaper is actually removable, which I didn't know. So, like, the head, it was, like, really light, so I was like, I don't think it comes with a bottle of blood. But then it did, and I was like, okay, got a bottle of blood, woo! And my fangs are being weird. And this was actually really cool, because I got it after I got home from school, and I was like, oh my gosh, is that a vamplet? And I read the thing, and it said vamplets, and I was like, ah! And, but I had to wait till my mom came home, and blah, blah, blah. But anyway, the diaper comes off, and I found out that the butt, I know, oh no, he's indecent, uh, but the butt is like beanie baby, sandish, beanbag kind of thing in the bottom, and the head is just kind of stuffed. It's very disproportioned, but very adorable. I really want to get Lily Rose, because she is my favorite vamplet, and she is adorable, and... I have a lot of vamplets on my wish list right now, but I might only get like one bottle of blood because I, I already have one now and I feel like I don't need a lot of them unless it like comes with the ones on the website. But I fan I, did you know on Amazon and is that uh, Mint Geek, you can find all of the old vamplets. Well, not all of them, like 2012 vamplets. Like you can find Rory Snow, you can find Lily Rose Shadowland, you can find Harrowless, you can find. Um, Silaclops. I think those are the only ones. Oh, and Hector. I have all those on my list. And if you're wondering what's on my hand, it's from lunch. My friend will, like wrote Muggle on my hand because she was calling me Muggle, and I was like, I'm not a Muggle, so I wrote Wizard, and then we decided we agreed that I was like Mudblood, especially by my face character. But it's it's Harry Potter stuff. Okay, I was gonna read the little description in his little card, which is adorable. It's like shaped like a tombstone. So let's read this. Oh, it's my cert official certificate of possession of a zombie baby that certifies that Mortis Van Kilt now resides in possession of his new keeper. Oh, I have to write in my name. I might leave this on. I haven't decided yet. It depends on if he ends up in my bed. Because if I keep, which he probably will, but if I keep him in my bed, this might poke me and I might cut it off. We'll see. Okay, now let's read the description and I will show you him while I read it. So you can awe at his adorableness. Okay, it says, Brainlessly adorable and weirdly sweet, this baby is totally out of control, as are all zombies. The joy and horror of bringing this little destructive darling home is rewarding, but can be fatal. 
Remember, your mind must tell me, baby, must always, you must always feed. Otherwise, you might become a late night snack. And that's why he comes with a bottle of blood. I'm going to remember to feed him. Um, we take no responsibility once adoption is complete. You have been warned. I think that's funny that they're always like, oh, warning you. And, um, more details about Mortis. He has the little bracelet that says bad, which is, like, for the bat protection thing that they were working on. I don't know if they're still doing that, but, like, they have a bunch of amplets with the... I don't know if all of them come with it, but I know that Mortis has a little bracelet, and... The head is, like, really huge. If you have not been able to tell that the head is bigger than everything else, then you're, like, crazy. But that makes for a really cute toy. Like, when I first saw these toys, I, like, didn't like them. But now I'm absolutely in love with Vamplets. And I'm thinking of making a little coffin crib for Mortis. And if I do, I will try and post, like, a video of how to make a Vamplet crib. Because... I made a bed for Jackie Laura once, but that was before I, like, started making videos. Um, I haven't really done videos on how to do stuff, but that was before I started making doll videos. And I'm just talking about things. And, um, the diaper is, like, purple with polka dots, but my camera makes it weird. And it has a little pink bow. I like that it has pink in it because, well, I like pink, but that makes me confused if it's a boy or girl. But I don't really care because it's adorable either way. It's got a little X on its foot. I like all the, like, stitched eye and how it looks very zombie-esque. Oh, I love it so much. I want to just squish my face all over it. <laughs> and it has a little, um, he, I'm just going to start call, referring to him as he. He has little hair tufts on the top of his head. It did have some clumps that were coming out, so I had to pull those out because they were, like, bothering me. But other than that, they've been good. Like, little hair tufts. I think they're adorable. Like I said, it might be a girl. But with Mortis, it sounds... To me, that Mortis sounds like a boy name. But maybe it's a girl because there's two bows in the hair. I think I'm just going to refer to it as an it. Because that's all I can think of. I don't know. It's still adorable. It's got a little tooth right here. Well... I guess that's it for this review. It's not really a short review, it's 10 minutes. Holy cow. But uh, I needed to show you how amazing Mortis is. Ah! And if you want to get Mortis, maybe still on sale. I could try to put this video up soon, but it's probably not going to happen. Probably by the time it's going to be up, it's going to be like... Maybe I could post it on Halloween. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. I could post this, post this video before another video because I can only like edit one video a week because I'm at school all week. So I can't like do that except for on the weekends and I'm busy all over the time of the day. Okay then. See you guys later. Bye bye. Uh...